Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome. Today, I'd like to talk about what I like to call an experimental playlist, which I think we should have. Now, to give some backstory of this, I've loved Halo for a long time, and the reason I really liked it was because Forge. Now, I know we don't want to get into a big topic as to why I like Forge, but I liked Forge because I could do whatever I wanted. I could make whatever I wanted. I would throw a bridge in the middle of the sky and have it float around, and me and a friend would just try and assassinate each other. It doesn't really sound like that much fun, but with us, it was. Uh, sometimes we'd make big flat areas and just try and make them as big as we can or we would just make a base and fill it with tons of weapons and Drive around and hog smashing each other up with no real end to it Now I think somehow 343 could make this into its own playlist um, Now what I mean by that is not just uh, no end to it. I mean an actual game type playlist but with 343, I feel like there are so many different things that you can do in the Halo sandbox that are just not able to be played with a ton of people like a lot of people want. So let's say you want to play a custom game. One, you have to make a custom game. You have to think of an idea. You have to design it. You have to forge it. And then you have to test it to make sure it's working out all well. Well, why not have 343 create a whole bunch of crazy ideas and throw them into Forge? Now, I don't mean just Action Sack. Don't, don't, don't think that this is just Action Sack because Action Sack is a great idea. You can have things like rockets where you run around and do that. And there's a whole bunch of simple things that you can do in game types that you can play with people. But I was thinking that they could even go above and beyond to create what a would be called an experimental playlist. Now, what I would expect from something like this is a playlist where they can rotate in a whole bunch of different maps, different game types that'll all be really unique. And they could just try things that they didn't know if were going to be good or going to be bad and make it an experimental playlist which will be exactly that just testing out things that could be cool now what I mean by this is a little over the top than just uh, the regular minigame playlist like let's say there is something like vehicle only slayer a BTB map where it uses the race type game type that forces you to go in a vehicle like when you try and hop out it'll teleport you back in something like that but you have to kill each other, so you'll have a whole bunch of people spawn a hog or a ghost, you'll randomly be in a vehicle, and you just have to kill each other, and it's Slayer. Or, maybe Super Jump, uh, Super Jump CTF, where it's just regular CTF, except every time you jump, you bounce off the top of the map. Now, this would be really cool if you're the person with the flag, because then people would have to jump up and try and kill you. Like, it would be a really vertical map, and I know a lot of competitive people like verticality, so this could really work out for them, too. Now, another thing could be, like, maybe Foot Fighter. Now, Foot Fighter could be, like, SWAT, except instead of having to shoot somebody's head, sh somebody's head is completely invincible, and so is their body, everything. You can't shoot them anywhere that will hurt them, except for their foot. You ever stub your toe on a couch, you'd be like, ah, frick, this is the worst feeling ever. Well, what if we did that with Halo? Where you take a BR or a DMR, and you shoot somebody in the foot, and they're immediately dead, but everywhere else, they're perfect. That would be a really cool idea, and Foot Fighter, I mean, switching up the, the, the ability to shoot your head and shooting your foot would be completely different when it comes to aiming. Uh, another thing could be maybe just like a big frickin' maze. Uh, you could even call it the big frickin' maze, and just make it a giant maze where there's a place where you have to get, and you just run to that part of the map. Really, really you can make that like a mini-game in customs, but, I mean, just create a whole bunch of different stuff. You don't know if it's gonna work out, you don't know if it'll be awesome, fun, or anything, but you could try out things. You could experiment. Maybe you want to put in a map, and you're just like, okay, I we, we have designed this map at 343, and we've done some throw testing, create a competitive map, but why not create some sort of maps that are based around the idea of mini games? Maybe a map that is based on that idea. I don't know, trying out new things. See, the thing is, this is so open-ended that it's really hard to think of a lot of examples besides the one I just said, because they could put anything they wanted when it comes to experimenting in there. They could try out new maps, new versions of maps. They could try out new game types. Maybe they want to throw in a new game type, something completely unique, just like Race and uh, Actions, and not Actions, like Ricochet was, throw in new game types and see if they work. If they don't work out, they could be temporary things that are just there to be tried out. They have a, a, an option like uh, companies love the option to beta test they they pay people to beta test their games to test out what they've created to see if it's good why not create a playlist that's dedicated to that there are so many people 
who love to try out new things even if they don't know if it'll work. A lot of times you'll create something in Forge and it won't work but it'll still be fun. That's what I'd love to see, the ability to do that. There is the preview program on Xbox, to try out the new dashboards. There are beta tests of games where people want to know how good the game is. Make a playlist that is dedicated to that, that you don't know whether it'll be fun, but you know that you're trying something new. And that could really spark something in the Halo community. If they were to just try and make as much as they can and then see what works, they could maybe have a new game type on their hands very quickly and they wouldn't have to just kind of pedal their feet trying to figure out, is this okay? Will the community hate it? Put it in a game type where there are no responsibilities. No, maybe not just responsibilities. It's still a game, but I mean, I love this idea. I'm, 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 I'm really passionate about the idea of having just a whole bunch of new stuff. And I feel like this could totally work out. That even goes farther beyond than just actions sack. So that was my idea. Uh, I hope that you guys thought this was cool. I'd love to do more idea videos like this, and if you agree with my idea, please post below what you would put. Foot Fighter? Maybe a big frickin' maze? Super Jump CTF? Vehicle Slayer? I don't know. Throw me your ideas. I'd love to see more of them, and I hope you enjoyed this. See you later.